Hello, this is Hisatsu5 and Chemo Kid 1ST, and this is part two of the Karambit or Hawksbill sharpening. Uh, if you watched my video earlier, or uh, part one, you saw me explain the chef's sharpening stool, the Gerber uh, bench stone, or any this represents any kind of bench stone. It doesn't really do that good for uh, Karambit or Hawksbill style. Spider Co. Serration sharpener, sharpen it like that, and my Smith's uh, field sharpener. And I want to uh, strike up on the uh, chef stick again just to show one more time. It's not really hard, slow motion. And I explained those in the first video, video and now I want to see if I actually did sharpen, and uh, if I didn't, I'll sharpen it. And uh, also was a uh, kind of sharpening, demonstrating sharpening the uh, Ringer Two knife from Columbian River Knife and Tool. In the same way as well, all you got to do is, and I explained that in the first video, so refer to the first video. And let's see if uh, that did any good. Well, I might have to, I might get another demonstration. My dog ran off with the paper. <laughs> I got another piece. That's Dixie. You've seen her in the K-Bar cut videos before. She's not new to our YouTube account. Okay. Let's see if I did any good. Oh. Ah, it's not doing as good. Field sharpening. Well, I'm glad I made this video so I had an opportunity to sharpen my Ringer 2 knife. Slow it down. There we go. There we go. And uh, this is a cool thing about Hawksbill. It's sharp now. Uh, my system does work. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for watching. Uh, comments and questions are welcome anytime. Thank you for all your comments and questions on our previous videos. Uh, have a nice day. I'm Hisatsu5, and I'm out.